18 days, they slept on the mountain, amazing. Well, they're majestic birds of prey, long on the endangered list, but bald eagles have rebounded from the verge of extinction. And as our Mark Holmberg tells us, even Central Virginians can marvel at these symbols of American pride. It wasn't that long ago, it was a real thrill to see an eagle. But here in Prince George County, right now, you can see them all over the place. I'm probably seeing at least five times more to 10 times more than what we normally see this time of the year, which is their nest and mating time of the year. Well, you gotta have a revolving head out here. And it might, you might never see this again, so you need to take it all in one time is the way we feel about it. You know, you get to see an awesome bird, symbol of the United States. Here in the Jordan on the James neighborhood, it's like the eagles have landed, a regular population explosion. I mean, how many of them are on this roof here as well? He said he counted 16 or 18. 16 on this we one roof. We saw 16 yeah. flying. And he These are likely young, unattached eagles. Remember, the young do not mature until they get to be about four or five years old, and that's when they get their white head and their white tail. Up to that point, they look like a vulture with some white splotching, depending on how old they are. But there are plenty of full-grown eagles in this fascinating swarm. No, it's not some Alfred Hitchcock thriller. But it's definitely pretty wild. One swoop down, got one of your neighbor's ducks? Yeah, one of the neighbor's ducks. And uh, I'd say about a month and a half ago, a cat was taken while the lady was looking at a cat walking down the street. So, you know, they're not, they're not picky about what they eat. It's unclear if this eagle burst is part of something bigger. It's the time of year. You know, we've got our northern eagles probably haven't left yet to go up to nest. They don't nest as early as ours do. Ours are all here because they start nesting in January. So what you have right now is just that lull in between. As soon as the weather will clear up just a smidge, a lot of them will take off and go north from us. Apparently because of the concentrations that we've now gotten in the, especially in the coastal plain of Virginia, many of our eagles don't ever find a mate because there's just, there's just too much of a dichotomy. There's too much fighting going on. Um, and so unless they spread out into the western parts of the state where they're not quite so dense, um, they don't necessarily have a very uh, good chance of finding a mate. Man, this is really wild just to sit here as the sun's going down, seeing one eagle after another in Prince George County. Mark Holmberg, CBS 6 News. And when you see when I saw one over the Lee Bridge a few months back, and it's just mesmerizing. You see that they white are. head, and it's just breathtaking because you're used to it's a symbol of the United States. It's very cool story. Very good to see them coming back. But if you live in that area, hide your small pets, huh? Yeah, it sounds like <laughs> it. Well, everybody's going to be inside the next few days anyway.